What's here? Light. Just had a big swirl. Right out in those weeds there, right in front of them. You know what's never failed to produce on that? I'll show you. On a swirler. Old Faithful. Uh, first one of the trip. Yeah, it did. We'll have to get that. Bath? Yeah, I think so. A little pipe. That's pretty cool. It's pretty big. It's not, I don't think it's a big one. But it's good size. Just past that log. It's coming in, so I know it's not a big one. Oh, he's got some fight to him. <laughs> yeah. He's gonna run when he gets to the boat three, four, or five times before we can net him if he's got any size to him. He's running right up the shore.
You want me to put this down and net them? <laughs> Woo. That's got some weight to it, dude. <laughs> That's the fifth one of the morning, by far the biggest. <laughs> it's the old man's lure! <laughs> From last week. Yeah, that's what I said. I said maybe it's got the old man's lure in there. <laughs> He's a hungry little bugger. Oh, that's too funny. Dad, when you go back to the camp next time, I'll have your lure hanging on the wall for you this time. <laughs> but I had to work to get yours back. Okay, so we got him unhooked. Got him unhooked, we're gonna let him go. I just wanted Dad's lure back and then we can let him go, so. There he goes. Good job, man. Number six in the morning. We haven't even left this little point. Might be all right. Let's keep. Let's keep this one. It does feel better. He wasn't really fighting until he seen the boat. Kill the motor. I might have to put this camera down and net him. Oh, I seen a flash of the lure. He's not that good. It's all scarred up. Bugger. <laughs> this one wants to live. He's got some fight in him. Hold on, hold on, don't. Getting all splashed. That would be a good size if you wanted to keep it. Let me see. It's about what, three pounds? Yeah. Yeah, we'll let them go. Oh, that's a nice one. Grab the net, dude. 
but your rod. Holy, hold that sucker up. Wow, man, that is a nice smallmouth. That's the nicest one we've seen come out of here, dude. A couple pounds. Hit it good. Probably about four, three, four pounds. Uh, yeah, over three. You'll make some good breakfast fillets. Yeah. I think that's number eight pike on the day and two bass. Pliers? So, yeah. Anyway, I'll give you a chance to uh, practice your five fillet method. Oh, I just got the camera going and he turned around and he disappeared. There he is, right there. Where? Right on the outside of the log. See him? Yeah. It's not bad. He sees a boat, he's gonna go. I'm thinking. Oh yeah. Now we'll see Grant's technique. It's not that big. Hold him up so we can see him. I gotta get this out. Not fighting? Uh, well, kinda, kinda coming in. So out of the water once we thought it was a bass. But we didn't really get to see nothing but a splash. Gonna run. Pike? Gotta be. Holy jumping, get the net! That's a monster bass. Did you see that? Yeah, I got it. I got it fully on the camera there where he jumped out fully.
Net ready. It's ready. <laughs> Holy crappers! The old man wanted to see smallmouth. Well, to get a picture or two of you. Oh, look at that. That's well the same size as one I had, eh? Yeah, pretty good though. Okay, I'll switch modes here and I'll take your picture. Oh, that's a big bugger. We're gonna let him go. The old man will be saying, what the hell? Catch you again another day. Go on. Look at this. You still running? Yeah. Look what came out of him. Little pickerel. Man, that's the biggest pickerel we've seen all day. Yep. Hey, I, that counts as two fish. I caught two and one. I'm up one pickerel and one bass. <laughs> Two cast, two fish. Number 11. Well, Patty's getting a pike. Now we just gotta get one for Fat Max. Okay, let's go down current. 